Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back to the ending of Disgaea 4, Promise Revisited. Last episode, we got uh, Judge Nemo to finally see Artina in her full angelic uh, presence. And now he's disappearing and we gotta save him so he can't take the easy way out and just disappear. We are going to turn him into a prinny, and that means we are facing a final boss, uh, who is not Desco. <clears throat> Actually, before I go, uh, I should mention I remembered to promote Cyrus this time, so he is now a gladiator. I also upgraded everybody's armor, because uh, they already mostly have the best weapons I, can, I could get for them at product rank 7. And I cannot really afford to get better weapons for everybody, so we're just going to make do with what we have. Alright, alright. Let's go! Final boss! <laughs> Defying God. Miss Artina? Why? Please, leave quickly. Otherwise, you will be dragged down into limbo, along with Fear the Great. Are you serious? Then stop hiding and come on out already! That's right! If you don't, Miss Artina is gonna be in more danger! Yeah, the princess doesn't want you to... to... take her away from the fire. She wants you to jump into the fire and rescue her! Time is running out. There's no time to argue. Just come out here. We're not leaving until we save your soul. Save me. Is that supposed to be a joke? No, we're serious. Sorry about that. I got a text from uh from my Artina, phone provider. Please leave me. I have committed something so terrible. It can't be undone. A sin which I will never be able to pay off. It's best that I just disappear now. Toughen up already! M Miss Artina! You might think this is how you'll pay for your sins, but honestly, that's not enough. You're just running away from your responsibilities. Disappear now? That's the cheapest and most cowardly way out! Miss Artina. You may be right, but how else am I supposed to do it? I'll tell you how. Become a prinny and pay off your sins. A prinny? You say that what you've done can't be undone, but there's no need to undo anything. Don't worry about anything else. Just work diligently as a prinny. It could take hundreds or even thousands of years to purify your filthy soul. However, every sin is repaid. No matter how long it'll take, I'll make sure you pay it off. You will? Indeed, that's the duty of a Prinny instructor. I'll help you too, with super hardcore punishment, so you'll be able to pay off your sins faster. You stay out of this, Fuka. You're not helping. Me too. I've already come up with some tasks for you. Like assassinating. <laughs> Desco wants to use you as a test subject for her new skills. I'll prepare something more mentally burdening. <laughs> uh, everyone? Are you even trying to convince him to come back? Well. He has the right to know the brutal path that's waiting for him. Not that I would let him back out now, <clears throat> but if he refuses to come. Valvatoris, I've done so much to you, yet you still do this for my sake? You'll make sure I pay off my sins? Of course, because I am Valvatoris, the Prinny Instructor of Hades. Valvatoris, I... Resisting 
power that's trying to keep him here. As the Korra fear the Great. <laughs> How persistent. And this was supposed to be created by God? Listen up, God! It is the demons who must punish the humans for their sins. Your turn ends here. Now leave the stage. <laughs> Your system is no longer needed. I'm pretty sure that somewhere out there God is laughing at this. But anyway, final boss. Uh, Judge Nemo, true final boss. He has a Malice Des X. Uh, that's pretty bad. 42,000 HP. Physical Malice. Summon a Malice unit to the map on every turn. Flooding Malice. Increase stats by 10% times the number of Malice units on the map. Final Boss Setting. Attack increases 20% per adjacent ally. Uh, B level Attack, which is uh, the strongest non signal target thing we've seen in a while. <clears throat> So, yeah, we are in for one heck of a fight. Uh, at present, you have entirely too much move there, uh, Judge Nemo. Anyway, uh, stats plus 60%. We are going to want to uh, reduce that to a more manageable level. I'll show you sardine power. Not gonna lose! We need to keep our distance from this guy, because uh, this thing's going to be pretty bad otherwise. all our units out here, although uh, here the way I have them spread out, uh, a couple of them are probably going to die this turn. Oh, nope. You're not even moving. Okay. Alright, carrying on. You definitely don't want to burn through all of your SP at, a, at this point, because uh, that would just be bad. Instead, we must, uh, we must consider our actions very carefully. And slowly clear these guys out. Actually, that's not good, because, uh, I need to adjust this area of effect here. That's better. Of course I missed. Here I come. What am I doing? You're facing Fuka. No wonder you. Uh, no wonder you didn't die. I'm still coming. All right. Let's have everybody face toward Fear to Great, so uh, so you can't try anything.
Let's see, how many malice units are left? Four. Looks like. Yeah. Four attacks, so uh, we have not seen, I don't think. Uh, of course, I can't hit. Alright, Fenric, you are going to defend. these guys out uh, and not worry about the boss right now, right this minute. <clears throat> Make a fire. Okay, where are we now? Plus 20%. That was a pretty epic looking attack, but it didn't actually kill anybody, so that's good. Alright, let's get these guys out of here. Uh, get some healing from emergency healing from Sasha. We're probably going to be losing a bunch of our units now, but uh, what you going to do, right? That works. Okay, that just that just leaves the one in the back. Oop, lost two of our guys. But you know, that's fine. For now, it's fine.
Yeah, we... We lost all of our healers. Dang it. Oh well, we're just gonna have to do this the hard way. Alright, Stella, I am putting you on Malice Duty. Alright, those are his real stats. And he's level 101 now. Because reasons. Alright, a couple more rounds of that and he should go down, assuming he doesn't kill everyone first. Like, Stella. He just killed Stella. percent resistance to everything. That's pretty bad. Let's be a little closer for that to hit. Catley Rave. Finally, another cross demon rush. Ooh, just barely. Seriously, what was that? Finish him off. Stronger than yours. The ties of our camaraderie. Lord Val. Mr. Vampire. Valvatores. Who are you? I am who you call God. What does God want with me? Are you angry because we defeated Fear the Great? The man you want to rescue must be terminated. You have done well, so I will postpone the extinction of the humans of Earth. But that man shall not be forgiven. He shall be executed. I see. So you called me out here just to tell me that? Yes, but I also wanted to meet the first person to ever defeat the Fear the Great program. I am honored to be called upon by God. Tyrant Valvatoris, you shall not oppose me. Fear the Great 
has but a fraction of my full power. Hey, God, may I ask you something? Have you ever been slapped? What? <laughs> There's more I'd like to say, but I'm a little busy here. For today, I shall only strike you once. But if you try to interfere with our world again, you shan't get off so easy next time. You dare to oppose the will of God? Of course! After all, I am a demon. Now brace yourself, God! For you are about to learn what pain feels like. My lord, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. What, what happened? Well, simply put, I gave God a beating. What? Though it is possible that that thing wasn't God. You mean because it had a female voice? Hmm, it's possible. I would have expected much more from God. Huh? Hmm, anyway, who cares? Take a look at that. Yay, we saved Judge Nemo. You were finally released by the persistent hands of God. I had no choice. You guys have done too much for me. Alpha Torres, you must have a lot of faith in Miss Artina. <laughs> what do you And you too, Miss Artina? You must have similar feelings towards him. Trust between a demon and a human. <laughs> well, I guess it's between a demon and an angel now. It's something that's very hard to believe for someone who's only seen the ugliness of wars amongst humans. Just one more time. I'll put my faith in this world again. Miss Artina, I don't know how many years it'll take me, but I will face my sins. And Valvatoris, I hope you'll guide me through it until my sins are paid off. Sure, you've got it. I'll beat some sense into your head once you become a Prinny in Hades. Yeah, <laughs> I'll make sure to be ready for that. Rascal, this is a job for you now. M me? Who else? It's a death's duty to send souls to Hades. Yeah, that's why I had him deliver the final blow. But, but I've never reaped a soul before. You can do it, Mr. Amizo! Yeah, just be confident, but don't cut off any weird parts. <laughs> Amizo, please. Uh, uh, okay, I'll do Judge Nemo, your life ended a long time ago. As death, I will reap your soul. Thanks. In the name of Death and Measle, I hereby sunder thy soul from this life. Judge Nemo, I'll see you in Hades. Finally, the worlds were saved by the hands of the rebels from Hades, led by Tyrant Valva Torres. Valvatoris, Fenric, Fuka Kazumitsuri, Imizel, Desko, Artina.
The names of these six heroes who saved the world were engraved into history to be taught for generations to come. On a side note, when Emisel was appointed to the position of Netherworld President, the name of President Axel was completely removed from public records and was forever sealed away in the darkness of history. <laughs> Valvatores, the sushi chef, or I guess sashimi, maybe. Unless those fish are still alive, in which case uh, I don't even know. But yeah, that was Disgaea 4. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed it. <clears throat> yeah, I was trying to come up with the uh, the name of some. Uh, of some highest goddess in mythology who could uh, potentially be responsible for all this, but I can't come up with anything. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure Yaldabaoth is uh, usually supposed to be male whenever he shows up, so I have no idea. Maybe the actions of the Persona 5 protagonist caused him to come back as a girl. <laughs> Yeah, I don't even know. I'm just being dumb at this point. Uh, Measle is settling into his job just nicely. <laughs> I am Death, the Slayer of Undead! Take this! <laughs> See this? I seriously need to turn on a fan in here. It's... better. Hopefully you guys can't hear that. Fuka is starting her own pretty baseball team! Heck yeah! <laughs> Desco is reaping the spoils of being an excellent final boss. I mean, she's 30 levels over the previous final boss. That's great! Martina opened a netherworld uh, medical clinic. Probably. <laughs> I like the mothman in the, in the bandage cocoon. That's pretty great. <laughs> Socks. My feet are cold. Axel! <laughs> Axel got assassinated! Good times. It'll be fine, though. He always comes back in the post game for some superstar shenanigans. And I mean, he was a major character in this game. There's no way he won't be joining the party eventually. Flan! Uh, Flan creates a Sentai squad. <laughs> you knew that was coming. <clears throat> Judge Nemo awaits the red moon. There's the main cast. Ooh, that is some nice artwork.
Hello, Mr. Vampire. Hey, what is it? Oh, uh, I just felt like we haven't really had a chance to talk yet. I knew you were that vampire from back then, but I was too focused on my task and... It's fine. I actually still can't believe that you're the same Artina. Who would have thought that pure-hearted Artina would have become a money-grubbing woman? Oh, please, give me a break. Yeah, she was just doing her job. I told you I wasn't collecting all that money because I wanted to. I know, but I can't help it after seeing all the excitement in your eyes when you were talking about money. Mr. Vampire, you've gotten a little mean. A demon mean, huh? Your fearless attitude towards demons hasn't changed. Ah, you really are, Artina. Mr. Vampire, I wanted to apologize to you. Apologize? <coughs> yes, to keep the promise you made to me, you continued to forbid yourself from drinking human blood. As a result, you lost your power and fell to Hades. I don't know how to express how sorry I am. You don't need to apologize. I only did that because I made the promise. Plus, I kept worrying about Judge Nemo while you suffered the whole time because of that promise. As Mr. Werewolf said, I'm just a hypocrite. Think whatever you like, but doing something is always better than not doing anything. Plus, by falling to Hades, I discovered sardines, a great source of nutrition. Actually, I should be thanking you for that. <laughs> Valatoria, you are such a dork. Oh, Mr. Vampire, I'm trying to be serious right now. I'm being serious too. <laughs> you really are, Mr. Weirdo. I'm glad we got to meet again. Likewise. Now, I finally get to keep the promise I made back then. Yes, I ended up making you wait 400 years. Right. As I promised, I shall only quench my thirst after I take you down to the depths of despair. <laughs> now, how shall I go about this? This will be most interesting. No, there's no need to do that to me. What do you mean by that? I've already seen the depths of despair. When you were dragged inside of Fear the Great, I thought I had lost you. You were deaf. My knees were trembling with fear just thinking about it. All I could do was stand there, trying not to scream out loud. Artina. You have kept your promise. Now go ahead. Take my blood. And please regain your power, Tyrant Valvatores, my Mr. Vampire. Aww. Collect more mana and go to the assembly. You might find a new topic. That being said, more is coming up. Okay. I want Fallen Angel Flan! <laughs> That's pretty great. Uh, Alright. I will have to, uh, I'll have to make a note of that. Got the Parallel Worlder. Got a... Oh, we got a whole bunch of dudes, including a, this treasure chest I can't quite reach. Oh well. Let's see what everybody has to say. I know we've been going on for a while, but uh, I plan on starting a new cycle to get all the other epilogues. <clears throat> Good time. Oh, this guy's just a map editor. <laughs> I 
Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Nothing has changed. All right, let me do a quick bit of the uh, research here. Let's call the Senate. I want Fallen Angel Flan, one hundred mana. Attend the Dark Hero live show. 1,000 mana. Go to Break Up Temple. 1,000. Oh, that's from the uh, that's from the legendary tree. All right, that's all a thing. This is the Time Traveler. Do you want to travel to past worlds? This is what lets you start a new game plus after uh, after getting to the post game. So, <clears throat> I'll be doing all that off screen, and next time we meet, we will be able to see the next epilogue, which will probably be Fenric. See you all then. Bye bye.